So this is MOSS, it's a modular robotic construction system that uses kinematic properties to create some really interesting behaviors. The first of which is just connecting two modules together. All of a sudden you get this interesting property of a universal joint like this. You pair a couple, you get a hinge, three or more, you start getting rigid structures. Now where this comes in really handy is in using something like our actuating angle block here, where if I hook him up to a battery like this guy here, what I can do is create a robot steering system similar to what we use on one of our uh, Bluetooth controlled cars. So you can see now that with this angle, angle block I can control it using this knob. Now I can hook it up to a more um, kind of dynamic construction here, so I'm going to take it like this, pair it with a couple of things, and then on this side here I can do a, the same thing, like this guy, pair that with the front end of this. You just need to connect it properly. Uh, power is passed through your Like this guy. And now using that same the technique as before, you can see that I have a much different behavior. And now that I have a steering system for the front end of a car. Compare that with things like a Bluetooth module that allows us to connect to iOS and Android devices, enabling us to build a wide variety of things. But we don't have to play with just Bluetooth. We can take these same components, reconfigure them all with without any programming whatsoever into an entirely different robot construction. So in this particular case, I'm going to just make a little spinning robot thing. Uh, right now I just have this guy hooked up to uh, the battery, but without input from the world, it's not going to do anything. So let's take something like this guy here, which is a proximity sensor, it measures distance to objects, and I'm going to hook it up to my little spin wheel, and now you can see as my hand gets closer, you can see the directional change of the wheel. I can take one of these wheels that we were using before and create a little bot that spins around on the ground like this, and responds to uh, my hand approaching it. Because it's modular in nature, we can switch things around and create different kinds of robots that respond in different ways. All of this occurs without any programming, which is great, which is great because it sets the threshold for play very low, allowing kids to get started with robotics, building their own creations in very different ways, enabling us to do a lot of different things without the need for programming. And then they